All right, guys, just a, just a tip. I think a lot of people might forget this, but it's really important. When you go to put your prop on, um, it's always important to put a little grease on that shaft. It really keeps that prop from seizing up on this prop shaft. You know, over time, I just get some grease, put it on there, and I try to get it on all those splines, and it will make it a hundred times easier to uh, put it on, take it off, you know, months down the road when you go to take it off. And that's something else super important, guys. And I don't do it often enough, but I should. And I try to. I try to at least once a month take my prop off and make sure there's not any fishing line behind it. It's just so important because you get fishing line behind it on that prop shaft. It's going to eat that, that seal out over time, get water in here, and then you're out a bunch of money. So a couple tips, putting that grease on. Um, then getting this thing on here like so makes it easy. The other thing is these washers. How do I know which one's which? You know, I've got them all mixed up. Here's how I remember it. Thick, thin, thick in that order. The thickest one first, the thin one, and then the next thickest one. That thin one is actually beveled. It actually keeps tension on that nut. Kind of a, an important thing also. Just remember, thick, thin, thick. Uh, put that nut on here. I carry with me this really cool uh, wrench right here. Um, just a, a, a right height jack plate makes it. It's got a metal insert, really handy. Um, also, this, this cool little uh, block. Two by four works great also. Be sure you get it lined up just perfect. And, uh, you know, you really want to tighten this thing on down. Um, I should know the foot torque pounds, but basically I've done it enough. I just tighten it till I can't tighten it no more. You know, with a wrench like this, it's, uh, you can't over tighten it. So get that thing on there tight. We're getting close. It's exciting getting your new boat already. And uh, can't wait to get it on the water today. There we go. Take a picture. That's kind of what it looks like right there. Hope that helps. Thanks, guys.